Welcome back, everyone. We are live right here, right now. We are Rudy's Barbecue on the circle in Waco with our party on the patio. Uh, it's a gray sky afternoon for us. It's going to be a, a, a damp evening. Before we get rid of the cloud cover, you're going to see some mist from time to time. Live look from the Baylor's Gotten Wide Health Sky Live weather camera in Waco. We're in the low 50s and upper 40s just about across the board. With the cloud cover, we're not going to see a whole lot of temperature change. As we go through morning, We'll probably cool down into the mid 40s, and that's probably about as cool as we're going to get tonight. Winds are still going to be out of the north. We'll get some clearing. Now, in those areas that get clearing, there's a good likelihood we'll see at least some patchy fog around the area. That doesn't last long. We get sunshine by tomorrow afternoon. It may be a slow uh, clearing process, but we will get some sunshine, sunshine by Friday afternoon and temperatures peaking back out into the 60s. We'll go 64 for a high temperature tomorrow. Good news with the rains that we saw yesterday. Burn bans have been dropped in many locations across Central Texas. In Comanche, Lampasas, and Limestone right now, we still have burn bans, but I would imagine those will get voted down by the uh, various county commissioners' courts in the next couple of days. Right now, cloudy skies, 53, 77% relative humidity, still looking at a very light north wind at three miles an hour. Tonight's going to be a gray sky night for us. It's going to be humid, and we will continue to see moisture in the forecast, at least in the form of mist and drizzle. We do anticipate clearing. We'll go 42 for a low tonight with a light northeast wind around five miles an hour, leaving us perhaps some patchy fog. Tomorrow, I'm going to be optimistic and call it fair sky, sunshine, mild conditions, and a high temperature getting up to 66 on your Friday afternoon. Winds will be shifting from the south to the southeast, and as we go into the evening hours, it's looking pretty good. Our pick game of the week for Friday Night Lights is Mart at Bosqueville. We should have partly cloudy skies. Temperatures still jacket weather for football. You're looking for readings down in the upper 50s at kickoff and in the low 50s by the evening's end. Saturday, you've got Baylor and Texas Tech teeing it up at uh, AT&T Stadium in Arlington. Again, temperatures in the 50s. It looks like tailgate time. It's 11 o'clock kickoff. We will be working our way up into the 60s for afternoon highs on Saturday as uh, Baylor takes on Texas Tech. All right, here's your Channel 6 seven-day forecast where your weekend is always in view. Anticipating some clearing, but we got a weak front going to try to come in here tomorrow. That'll push those winds back around to the northeast briefly. Then they go southeasterly on Saturday. That's in uh, ahead of a next system coming in on Sunday, about 30% chances of showers. It still looks good for the Veterans Day Parade in Colleen. I hope you all will come out for us. Uh, a lot of the Channel 6 folks will be in the parade. Uh, we're going to be carrying it on the, li on the air as li live as well. So you don't want to miss that. Party on the patio winner this week is Sean Brodeen of Lorena. Sean, tell me a little bit about yourself. Oh, not a whole lot to tell. Well, I can tell you're a sharp dresser. <laughs> you look great here. Nice bunch of folks here. Your family? Yes, sir. Who's that very uh, shy young lady? That would be my beautiful little daughter, Kaylee. Not oh. shy, really. No, not shy at all. My wife, Mary, my son, Jonathan, my father, John, and my favorite uncle, Dan. There you go. All right. You can get in, in on one of these parties on the patio just like Sean did by going to our website, kcentv.com. Follow the links to get registered for your chance to win. We're going to enjoy some barbecue here. Tell you more about Rudy's Barbecue coming up during the 6 o'clock newscast. Back to you. All right, Andy. Enjoy what you're not going to bring me. <laughs> well, coming up next, their mission is...